This is Wendy Stum with StreetPainting.tv and I'm speaking with Anthony Capetto, a street painting artist who is street painting at the San Rafael Festival in California. How are you doing today, Anthony? I'm doing great, Wendy. Glad to be here. Anthony, what can you tell me about the piece that you chose for this festival? Well, I decided that I wanted to uh, make a good impression with uh, the theme of the festival this year, which is celebration of the spirit of youth. So I gave the idea some thought, and I came up with the idea of a uh, little girl as topiary, as almost like a, like a trimmed hedge in the form of a figure. And I decided to put her within a, a group of hedges with some beautiful flowers and, uh, and some trees in the background using the 3D technique for a special effect. And what is the theme of the festival this year? Uh, the theme of the San Rafael Festival is a celebration of the spirit of youth. Okay, so I understand that um, you do a lot of garden street paintings with gardens and architecture, so you decided the spirit of youth to be the girl topiary in your garden. Yes, I made her the center of um, the garden to uh, portray the spirit of youth to all viewers and have them take their interpretation of how beautiful it can be. I understand that you are street painting between uh, two international artists this year. One of them is an Italian street painter and the other is a Mexican street painter. Are you having a good time um, street painting with them? Absolutely. How can you not have a good time when you're with such good people as you find here in San Rafael? Despite the fact that they are from different countries, are um, you able to communicate with them well about such aspects of street painting? The, the communication of artists can be universal. I mean, we can speak enough words in each other's languages to understand each other fundamentally, but we understand better is the ability to do our work, to enjoy each other's skill, and occasionally to pass that talk around that you need when you run short. Do you find that uh, the artists that you're working beside have different techniques than you do? Yes, absolutely. Juan Andres has a very precise, delicate style that comes out beautifully in his work, and uh, Bruno Fabriani has a, a beautiful religious um, method of creating his pieces, which is um, emotionally strong to behold. And then my own work is more of an impressionist style in which I express my vision of creativity in a much looser but effective style. Hey, what do you think of the overall atmosphere at uh, the Youth and Arts Italian Street Painting Festival this year? I would say, it's, as it typically is, wonderful, fantastic. You want to come back over and over because you meet great people, see fantastic art, and you're helping in good causes. And Anthony, have you seen um, younger artists uh, participating this year at San Rafael, and how, how is their work going? I've been walking around this festival and uh, taking a look at some of the artists of you know, different ages, different experiences throughout the festival. And I have to say that with every year, the talent grows and gets better, and everybody is dedicated and just likes to doing what they're doing. And I just see a lot of positive things coming out of the younger generation of artists here. And that's truly what creating this art, I feel, is all about. Well, great. Anthony, thanks for speaking with us today at streetpainting.tv. Always a pleasure. Hope to see you soon.